Let us now take an example based on the concept of partnership that we have just discussed. The question here is, Meena started a business investing rupees 12,000. After 5 months, Abhay joined her with a capital of rupees 9,000. At the end of the year, the total profit was 4,416. What is the share of profit of Meena? So as we can see here, the investment made by Meena is rupees 12,000. After 5 months, the second person Abhay joined her with a capital of rupees 9000. That means investment made by Abhay is 9000. And at the end of one year, at the end of the year, that is after 12 months, when the profit was calculated, it came out to be 4460. So we need to find out what will be the share of Meena out of the total profit of 4416 rupees. Now, as discussed, we know that profit of Meena by profit of Abhay should be taken as investment made by Meena into time of Meena's investment divided by investment of Abhay into time of Abhay's investment. That is nothing but profit of any partner is proportional to his investment into the time of investment. So by substituting the given values, we know that investment made by Meena is 12,000. So 12,000 into the time of Meena's investment here is nothing but 12 months because Meena has started the business. And at no point it is mentioned about Meena leaving the business. So very clearly Meena was there in the business for the whole period of one year. So we can say that she was there for 12 months. Divided by the investment of Abhay is 9000 into the time of Abhay's investment. As you can see here the question says after 5 months Abhay joined with the capital of 9000. That means in the total period of 12 months, Abhay was not present for the first 5 months as he has joined after 5 months. So very clearly he was present only for the last 7 months. That is nothing but 12 months minus 5 which is 7 months. So Abhay's investment of 9000 was present for 7 months. So this will give us the ratio of profits between Meena and Abhay. So by simplifying this we get 3 into 3, 3 into 4 and again 3 ones and 3 fours. So this ratio can be taken as 4 into 4, 16 by 7. So very clearly the profit of Nina is to profit of Abhay is in the ratio 16 is to 7. And we are supposed to find out the share of Nina. So as already discussed from ratios we can say that profit of Nina will be 16 parts out of the total 16 plus 7. That is nothing but 23 parts. 16 plus 7. 23 parts multiplied by the total profit of 4416. So this comes out to be 16 out of 23 into 4416. And by simplifying this, we get the answer as 3072. So we can say that the profit of Mina out of 4416 should be 3072 rupees. So friends, this is how we can solve the questions from partnership simply by finding out the ratio of profits to be shared between the two persons and then finding out the individual profits.